What really happened between Medvedev and Zarev during their Monte Carlo thriller? This will give him the chance to try and serve this match out. this stage in a match to come through quickly Medvedev's racing off to the toilet I think I think he uh, he actually asked Carlos Bernardes during that game whether he could go at the end of the game obviously he's got to make sure that he's back in time Words that Sasha last night said. He said he's one of the most unfair players in the world. They take fair play and sportsmanship very serious. He does not. He takes a toilet break when it's not possible anymore. If you want to answer this, uh, yeah. First of all, I do think that honestly, with probably 90 players on tour, I'm great friends. With maybe 50, I'm. It's not like best friends, but really great relationships. So um, I usually feel bad when something on court happens and let's say I'm not fair play because I know sometimes I'm not yesterday uh, what the, the thing with the, with the stick made him say this toilet uh, well I wanted to be what does he want me to do and let's take it step by step 
so 2 all no 3-2 I have like 5 breakpoints or whatever he manages to hold congrats then I make the game 40 love for me I go to the toilet I lose next two games he's serving for the match and he's saying I'm going to the toilet uh, to make him play worse like uh, Sasha is living in his own world I already had like 5 players uh, uh, in the locker room coming to me and uh, saying come on Daniel why why are you so unfair and uh, yeah Sasha when he loses uh, we can find maybe 25 interviews uh, of him where he, he does say some strange things and uh, again honestly saying like if guys like Kasper uh, I don't know Andre uh, maybe Karen uh, even Diego so uh, I had a let's call it a fight with him in ATP Cup honestly I'm at fault and probably he still like doesn't like me the way maybe he liked me before this match and I'm sorry that a guy like Diego so kind and so fair play feels like this about me Sasha is not this guy Sasha is not like Kasper is not like Diego is not like Andre when he says someone is not fair play you're like okay great uh, look at yourself in the mirror more than rivals, I thought you would be even friends. Is that not the case on the one hand? And on the other hand, how disappointed maybe are you that he does this publicly and doesn't approach you directly in order to solve that problem with you instead of the way he chose it? Uh, first of all, I, I think it's, it's tricky because I don't want to say too much because he probably did it, uh, when was it? Like straight after the match probably, right? Yeah, you're in the heat of the moment, so if he says the same in one week, different story. If he changes his mind, different story. I can understand, you know, after the match many things can happen. I just saw that uh, Mane and Sane apparently had a fight or whatever. It's after the match, you know, heat of the moment, he lost a tough one. He, he was serving, so I'm, go I'm not going to go too much into uh, details. Uh, just going to say we're never really close friends, maybe only in juniors. Uh, that's only him in his uh, congratulations speeches uh, saying something like he was uh, friends with uh, me and my wife which is definitely not the case uh, since long time I never said this um, and so yeah it doesn't disappoint me at all but again if in one week he's going to continue saying well I'm going to come to him in the locker room and say let's discuss what's what's wrong tell me I'm going to tell you and maybe we're never going to speak again and we're going to be enemies or whatever but at this moment, I don't care much.